up, Woody Nerdigans? This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And this is the Ninja Kitty Sino Asagiri. And today's Manga Nerdigan Live Reaction video is going to be for Forto 2 Blue Vortex Chapter 2, aka Forto Chapter 82. But before we get into this recap and live reaction, let us just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored, if you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, live streams, or live reactions like this one, Feel free to hit up our Cash App and PayPal. Links are in the description box below. And also, because our live stream was a success last month, we're definitely having one for Chapter 2, which will be on September 20th. And for more info and updates on it, make sure you are following us on Twitter and are a part of our Discord. That info is in the description box below as well. So, ooh, last chapter was so epic oh my god so we got to see what's been going on since the time skip um in regards to what my thoughts on um the time skip itself yeah this is why you gotta watch my live stream because <laughs> that's where i go in, in depth about that but that the code invasion though with the freezer race yeah let's be real that's the freezer army right there um was boss but then we got Boruto's return. I swear to God, if Sasuke died off screen, I'm gonna be pissed. Oh my God. Or if he's injured off screen, I'm gonna be pissed. But again, those thoughts are are in the live stream. I'll put the link to that in the description box below to boot so you guys can find it. Um, but anyways, let's get to this chapter and into the code versus Kawaki versus Borto and see what's in store for us this month and of course we got Sarda on um on the cover and god if my finances weren't fucked up I would be cosplaying as her well that and my body is not back to where it is just yet I'm working on it I'm working on it but god damn I want to wear this outfit really bad I do I don't know why people are hating on this outfit though why they're saying that Sarda looks like a hooker. She don't look like a hooker. You guys are... Those motherfuckers are stupid. I swear. They need to go outside and touch grass. Inside of the memories is... And also this background. Oh, this background is everything. Yes. Chapter 2 is titled Tree. The surprise invasion is part of a revenge plan from Kara's Remnants Code. Oh, um, amidst the chaos in Kanoa, he suddenly appears. I've been looking for you, Borto. I didn't expect you to come out so easily. If that's the case, you should have come to Kanoa sooner. Withdraw your monsters from here, every last one of them, while you still can. If you do that, I'll spare your life. Dude, Borto is such a badass. Oh my god, he's such a badass. Dude, look at Sarda, though. She's like, whoa. I think she's turned on by this. I do. Maybe that is my delusional fanfic um, going on up in here. Because I ship them so hard. The, uh, but... The, Dude, she is turned on. She is. Oi, wait a sec. What do you say? Two years ago, didn't you run away from me without doing anything? You are telling me that you'll spare my life? You heard it right. If you understand, just do it already or this time. Um, you won't get away with just your left eye. Woo! So now we know, we got confirmation here that Boruto was the one that delivered the blow to his left eye. It wasn't Sasuke. It was Boruto. God damn it. I need to see this fight. As I said in my live stream, for the love of freaking God, if we do not see this here, if we do not see this here in the manga, this fight, what I want is I want something similar to Grudge of Edinburgh for, for Tazai slash uh, uh, Four Nights of the Apocalypse, where Kishimoto does the writing and... But instead of, like, the CGI shit we got for our Grudge of Edinburgh, we get the Black Clover movie. Art and animation. Yes! I need that shit in my life. Hell, even if it's, even if we do get in the manga, Periot slash Chibi Tokyo, you know that would be the smart thing to do. You want to make money? That is how you make money, is by doing that shit for Boruto. Not some dumbass filler movie for Black Clover. Oh, God, yeah, I will forever be salty about that stupidity. I will, oh, there was so much they could have done for a Black Clover movie. But no, we didn't get that shit. Would have been such a good intro to fucking Spade Art, too. 
Um, wait a minute. Yeah. There we go. Anyways. I'm surprised coming here and bluffing around. I can't help but laugh. It's hard as like, what the fuck? She she is happy that Borto is there, but she's just like she's also like, what the fuck? Borto, Sarda, there's a lot of people out there who didn't make it. Um, you take care of that. Leave this to me. You you alright? We'll talk later, but first stay alive. I'm telling you! I am telling you, Sarda is so turned off by this! She's so turned off by this! I know she's happy to see Borto, but dude, you have to wonder I, I think she's turned on by this, but if she's not, then I will be extremely surprised. Seriously. Shadow Bind Technique. Ooh. Okay, here we go. We, AKA the Kashibari no Jutsu. Rah! Yeah, we get to see everyone else fight the Freeze Array. Sweet. Incredible. These guys, they're just numbers. They ain't much. Oh, that's what they said about Metacooler. That's what they said about Metacooler's numbers up in, uh, um, oh, God, what movie was it? It wasn't Revenge of Cooler. Oh, God, not, uh, my memory's ass right now. Um, woo! Chow Chow? Uh, let's say Chow Chow. Chow Chow, behind you! Huh? Woo! Dude! Inojin, yo! Jeez, don't let your guard down, you fast! <laughs> uh, I'm not a fat ass! Thanks, Inojin! <laughs> Dude, I hope the normies aren't reading this, because then they would be saying Mofo is fat shaming Chocho. We don't need Kishimoto getting death threats. Damn it! Now I remember the movie. It's the return of Cooler. Duh. But yes, that is what it is giving. It is giving very much um, Meta Cooler's uh, clones in the return of Cooler on the Bangetti Star. Himawari chan! Oh no! Well, there's Kawaki. Out of my way, you guys. Kawaki, big bro! Woo! Dude. Ooh, the freeze of breeze can. Damn it. I'm trying not to call it. Dude, that is meta cooler. I, 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 meta cooler clones. Dude, the meta. The free. I kind of caught the meta freeze erase. There we go. The meta freeze erase. Oh, they, they, they ain't happy. Nah, they are growling. Um, They are feral uh, meta freeze erase clone. <laughs> They're feral, feral meta cooler clones. There we go. Thank you, big bro. Stop calling me that. How many times do I have to tell you? But, ooh, Himawari got to figure it out by now. Boy, this guy, uh, um, these guys are different than the other claw grimes. It's more like superior. Ooh. It's definitely different from the other Frieza race. Different from the other, uh, Meta Frieza clones. Or the feral Meta Frieza clones. Kawaki! Oh, su su ki Oh, I can talk! Ah, get out of here while you can, Kawaki. I can't hold it longer. I, I can't hold it much longer. Ah. Otsuki, it pisses me off when people call me that. Get him, Kawaki! Yeah! Whoa! Su- Huh? Ooh, there's no- and then, damn it, again, this is why I got to compare to the Metacooler clothes, man. They're just, oh God, it's so much like it. How many of them are there? It doesn't matter. I'll destroy every last one of them. Motherfucker, that's what Goku and Vegeta said up on the Bangetti Star. They said they would be able to do it. And guess what? They got caught anyway. And they even went Super Saiyan for that. All right, let's see what Boruto's going to do. Ooh, okay. Ooh, Porto for the trap! Let's go! Dude, this is giving tr Dude, let's be real. That was stiff. That is stiff. Damn it, Ikamoto. Oh, I love you, man, but God, sometimes your art frustrates me because it's stiff. He should. Okay, Porto should be.
should be leading, for those of you that are wondering why I'm frustrated and why I'm calling it stiff, Boruto should be leaning a little bit more forward. And the, um, if his shoulder was leaning a little bit more, then um, I would be happy with it. But man, it is stiff. It is stiff. The legs are fine, but the shoulder is not. I know it's nitpicking, but god damn, it's just, oh, there's little things like that, man. It makes a huge difference. Ooh. Dude, this is some Trunks and go on shit right here. It's Trunks when he's taken down the, uh, when he took down, um, uh, Metal Frieza and Gohan, Super Saiyan 2 Gohan, when he took down the, um, uh, the Cell Juniors. That's what this is giving. It's a combination of that and I love it. Dude, I love how much this is giving Trunks and Super Saiyan 2 Gohan. Oh my god, it freaking is. It is, it is, it is. So there's no way you're just bluffing. <laughs> Dude, now Code is giving like, I don't know if you guys would say Code is giving um, either Frieza or like King Cold real, uh, realness here. But man, God, I kind of want to say he's kind of giving like Metal Frieza in a way. or Mecha He's kind of giving that because he was kind of, Frieza was kind of like that. Part of me is like he's kind of giving King Cole because King Cole is like that too. If you're still going to do this, there, I want to know. Let me know in the comment section. Again, this is why I'm going to be doing doing this discussion on um, on uh, September 20th. And this is why I love doing the discussion uh, last month too. That was so much fun. If you're going to uh, still do this, there won't be any of them left. And don't get uh, too cocky just because you killed a few. There's plenty more of them out there. Besides, they're just tools for me. You still don't, uh, ooh, <gasps> you still don't understand the true horrors of the Ten Tails. Yeah, get to the Ten Tails, let's go. What did you say? Fire release. Ooh, great fireball technique. Yeah, sorry to get him. Chidori. Woo. She, she, amazing. Are you really a Genin? It doesn't matter right whether I'm uh, a Genin or a, uh, or a Junin. Uchiha behind you! Ooh. Oh. That's... Sogi-san, what the fuck?! Hell... What the fuck?! This is a tree? Dude, he turned him into a tree! What? What's going on?! I've known about ten tails. Of course you do. They eat otsutsukis. Well, the truth is, they're just a beast that uh, feeds on anyone and everyone on instinct until the time they find an otsutsuki. That's right. These, remember, the ten tails. That's I, how did I forget about this? The the Frieza race here. Um, remember that uh, that code turned the ten tails into the Frieza race up in here. And that's why they're turning into trees. Oh my god. Until the time... Uh, let's see. read this again. They eat Otsutsukis. Well, the truth is, they're just a beast that feeds on anyone and everyone on instinct until the time they find an Otsutsuki. Normally that might be true, but not anymore. That's because of the transformation you added. Woo! Well, that explains the feralness of it all. But there's still time. You've held the ropes to hold... Um, uh, to hold them, you can annihilate them right now. Otherwise, they're headed for the worst future everyone can imagine. What? What is your point now? When the Ten Tails ate Otsutsuki, it will take um, a root on this great land and become a divine tree. When that time comes, this planet will perish. That worst future itself is my objective. I'll only say this one time, Code. I'll let you leave. In exchange, you will lead me to the place where you hid Ten Tails' real body. But that is... An, but... The Frieza race are the, um, are the Ten Tails real body, though. Even stupidity, <laughs> even stupidity has its limits, Porto. Have you lost your mind? I'll be blunt. Killing you is easy. Rather, um, than just dying in vain, why don't you do one good thing for the world instead of wasting your life? That's bullshit. You're the one who's going to, uh, who's going to die. There's no saving for this idiot. <laughs> hmm? It's for Sengen. Um, this fool, he doesn't think I knew about it? 
shunned from his hometown and now being chased. What kind of new power did Boruto gain in the midst of it? Woo, Red Second! Listen, what? Red Second is a Hiko? What the fuck? So, Uzuhiko's swirling lad, and then the Red Second is obviously the, um, the wind spear. Dude, remember, remember when we got that one shot, um, from Naruto's dad, aka Boruto's granddad about, um, uh, Sengen. Holy shit. Okay, this is wild. But the people turning it into trees after being bitten by the Frieza race here makes a whole lot of sense. Because as it, because remember, I can't believe I forgot about it until the, the until just this moment. Remember, the, um, what Ko did um, was turn the ten tails into the freezer race. That's what they are. What those, what those clones are. They are, they are the ten tails. So it's interesting that they're biting humans, um, instead of, you know, going after the Otsutsuki, but it also makes sense why they're saying, Ooh, it just hit me. So why, um, they started biting humans. And it's because of Kawaki. Because they smelled Kawaki. They sent, and he's, remember, he's a Dotsutsuki. Because of that, that's why they started biting humans. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. So I want to go back to what Code said here. Um, where is it? Um, they eat Otsutsukis. Well, the truth is they're just a beast that feeds on anyone and everyone on instinct until they, uh, until the time they find an Otsutsuki. Well, they found an Otsutsuki and, uh, well... Well, at least one of them found an Otsutsuki, and probably what happened is because they're probably, since, you know, all of them were created from the Ten Tails, they probably um, are all connected, right? So, the moment one of them said, oh, that one that said Otsutsuki, that probably sent a signal to the rest of the clones, and that's what set it off. Um, that's what set them off to start biting them, because there's no other way, right? Ooh. Dude, I can't wait to discuss. See, this is why, shit like this is why I like doing the, um, why I'm really excited to do a live stream on this. Um, but we'll co definitely be comparing it to the Viz translation, um, to see what the difference is. Because, man, this translation is, is... I hate this localizations. I really fucking hate them. I do. Oh, my God, I do with a passion. I wish there was a different translation for Dragon Ball Super. That's another one I, I would love to have a different translation for. Because, God damn, it's terrible. But I'm very curious what you guys think about this chapter. I think this is very interesting. He did say... But the other thing that I'm... Um, That uh, Borto said here. Well, Borto asked where um, Code hid the real body. Does Borto just not know that the Freezer race are um, are the Ten Tails? Or I wonder if something happened during the time skip where um, we're not all or. Uh, or some of the ten tails was stored in a secret spot, and um, and on some of the ten, he took. I don't think that'd be stupid if Code took all the ten tails with them, the ten tails clones with, or you know, the freezer race clones with him. He had to take it. Um, if he took all of them with him, that um, everywhere all the time, that would be. I think that would be stupid, right? I wonder if like. Code has like a pocket dimension or something where he has uh, some of the clones or, or what? I'm very curious what you guys think. 
about this. But yeah, those are definitely, from what I remember, those are the Ten Tails. He turned the Ten Tails into those Freezer Race clones. So I'm curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. And remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. Love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more Borto content. few ways you can do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Until next time, Nerdigans, I will be seeing you later. Bye.